This is my intro song. It isn't very long. That's all. Go ahead. Go on, watch the video. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, my lovely Diamond Cubs. Welcome back to Berry Q Nails. I'm so happy you're back. Love y'all so much. Mwah. I'm still rocking these nails. My Rokoko set. And my fall nails. So um, I wanted to do a special video because I won a giveaway from Creations by Brie. I was so excited. I, was, I couldn't believe it. I was like, oh my gosh, you just, just randomly one day she just popped a little giveaway in um, her comment section on one of her videos and I saw it and I was like, oh, okay. So yeah, I won and she asked me to send her my contact info and I got the package. So I wanted to share it with you all. Before we get into that, are you subscribed? Because we recently hit 500 subscribers and we are going higher. Thank you so much to all of you that have subscribed. I appreciate you so, so much. If I have not chatted with you i would love if you can comment just so i know you're there i don't always get a notification on you know a new subscriber or anything so it would be awesome if you can comment let me know you're there and we can chit chat it would be awesome y'all know i love to talk and uh converse back and forth so Again, thank y'all so much for helping us get over that huge milestone. And we're just going to go up and up, honey. So, thank you so much. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Hit those bell notifications. Never miss a video. So, alright, so here is the package. Creation by Brie. So thank you for supporting a small business. So, I did open it already, y'all. You know, I can't I couldn't help myself, so. But here we go, so y'all can see. She sent me her entire collection of her acrylics from her Genesis collection. So exciting. So look at these. Creations by Brie. Genesis collection. So what I love about these is that these are very unique. These are actually named after verses in the Bible. So if you see here, this one is seven. This one, John 16, 33. Might as well take these out at the same time. This one is after the Garden of Eden. This one is Jeremiah 29, 11. This one is Matthew 7, 1. This one is Corinthians 13, 8. Deuteronomy 31, 8. Proverbs 3 5. Let's put a little note. Thank you for your continued love and support. Please let me know your honest thought. XOXO Brie. She is so kind and so sweet. Y'all definitely need to check out Creations by Brie on Instagram. She has a YouTube and DM her for her mystery boxes so y'all can get some of these as well. All right, so let me just get this all out of the way, and then I'll be right back. All right, so while I'm getting a little set up, I did want to do a little background on the collection. So if I'm not mistaken, from what I learned from Brie, um, the Genesis collection came up from uh, the Old Testament in the Bible, and... The book of Genesis explains how uh, God created the world and how 
Adam and Eve came in and he created them nude. And so she decided to do sort of, sort of a nude collection. Please correct me if I'm wrong, Brie. Uh, you know, I'm not that versed, so I'm doing my best. <laughs> so um, here we're just gonna be doing some swatching and I'm gonna switch over to voiceover and I'm going to be doing some readings of what these passages are. So I hope you enjoy and I'll be back. All right, amen church, amen. We are going to be reading some scripture. So this beautiful acrylic is Proverbs 3, 5. Trust in the Lord with all of your heart and lean not on your own understanding. This next one is Matthew 7, 1. Do not judge or you too will be judged. I thought it appropriate to include the second part of that. For in the same way you judge others, you will be judged. And with the measure you use, it will be measured to you. Amen. everybody doing okay out there I hope you are I hope it's not too hot because you know it's hot in these streets this one is Jeremiah 29 11 for I know the plans I have for you declares the Lord plans to prosper you and not to harm you plans to give you hope and a future We have Corinthians 13, 8. Love never fails, but where there are prophecies, they will cease. Where there are tongues, they will be stilled. Where there is knowledge, it will pass away. everyone just popping in to say thank you so much if you're still watching and please if you have not subscribed please consider subscribing and hitting that bell notification icon
Next we have John 16, 33. I have said these things to you, that in me you may have peace. In the world you will have tribulation, but take heart, I have overcome the world. Next up, we have Deuteronomy 31, 8. The Lord himself goes before you and will be with you. He will never leave you nor forsake you. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. I hope you're enjoying the video. Did you click the like button? Did you subscribe? All right, just check in. for this next one this one is seven the number seven is very significant in the bible appearing over 700 times throughout both the old and new testaments in biblical numerology seven symbolizes completion or perfection it is said that god created the world in six days and rested on the seventh additionally there are seven churches in the book of revelation seven seals seven trumpets, and seven bowls. The number seven is also associated with important biblical figures, such as the seven deacons chosen by the apostles and the seven spirits of God mentioned in Revelation. This next one is Garden of Eden. In the Old Testament book of Genesis, biblical earthly paradise inhabited by the first created man and woman, Adam and Eve, prior to their expulsion for disobeying the commands of God. The Lord God planted a garden eastward in Eden, and there he put the man whom he had formed. And out of the ground the Lord God made every tree grow that is pleasant to the sight and good for food. The tree of life was also in the midst of the garden, and the tree of knowledge of good and evil. swatch stick but I didn't have any more so Brie I hope it's okay that I'm swatching on a black swatch stick I feel it actually pushes up and enhances these colors that you created and I'm kind of loving it I'm loving it <laughs> all right my love so here are all the swatches from Creations by Brie, Genesis Collection. So this first one we have is the Proverbs 3.5. We have 
Corinthians 13, 8. John sixteen thirty three got Matthew seven one Jeremiah twenty nine eleven Deuteronomy 31.8 7 And we have a Garden of Eden. So in addition to all of the variety of nude acrylics uh, named after verses in the Bible, we also have the Garden of Eden. And look how beautiful. I love all the colors. Gorgeous. Thank you so, so, so much creations by Brie. Make sure y'all go and check her out on Instagram and YouTube. Thank you so much for being here. I love y'all so, so much. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't and turn on those bell notifications. Peace. Oh, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Pushing out that positivity towards all of y'all. Pushing out the good vibes. Good vibes. Pushing them out to y'all. Now.